I think I've fallen for you And I don't know why I don't know why You love the summer rain In mid-July Mid-July My last name fits you better When I'm with you there's no pressure I miss your worn out sweaters Weather couldn't compromise our love I spent too much time on us And I think you got me stuck on loving You can't function I gotta tell you all my secrets And you know that Hello guys, good morning Welcome or welcome back to my channel So... I'm vlogging. It's my first day back home. I mean, I still have my schoolhouse for the rest of the month, but I came home after my last final yesterday of my college career, literally ever. So thank God for that. I decided to vlog. I have a few things I want to do today and I miss vlogging, like I say in every vlog, but I'm sad because I didn't vlog a lot of my like school this semester. I know, I just didn't and I'm upset about it. That's fine. We're going to vlog today. When I'm home, I use like my ice roller and I put a little eye things underneath, not for it to like help me in any way, but because it feels good. I put those in the fridge under eye patches and then this obviously the freezer but it just feels really good so i've been doing it today we are going to the gym i want to get back into it now that i'm gonna be home for who knows how long I'm going to do that my hair is a mess i need to brush it i really want to finish the book that i'm reading today so i could start a new one i am so beyond over it but we'll talk about that a little later we'll talk about post-grad stuff i have errands to run i really want to go to trader joe's today i need to find like grad shoes for graduation so I might go dsw i don't know we'll see where life takes us so that's today just got ready for the gym it's like raining out so that's not fun but i am just in a lemon long sleeve and leggings comfortable you do a moisturize and do my skincare i was thinking of doing like a video like dedicated to my hair care skincare and makeup routine like all in one i got a lot of questions about every single one i don't really talk about that ever and i was not crazy any of those but i might do that soon we'll see let me know if you guys want that because i get questions about that and i don't have like a specific video really people can go to that are more recent about all that stuff so just let me know okay i'm gonna go do my skin go to the gym and i will take you guys with me it's gonna be a fun day that you guys are gonna spend with me let's go Hello guys, we just left the gym. We weren't there for long. I go with Lauren, if you're new here. We went to the gym. If you've been on my channel like last year, I guess it was like around summertime, like right before summer into summer. We were like huge gym girls, like every day. And I loved it like so much. I was actually like trying and stuff. And we went to school and we didn't want to like commute to the gym. We had our membership, we froze it, whatever. Now that we're back, we're trying to go again, but it's just like not fun. We do like weightlifting and like some like cardio if we feel it. But I'm just like so over it and I'm bored with it. And it's just like not fun and i think i just have to get back into it but like i don't know like, i wanted to do like yoga and pilates and stuff like that but i like the way my body looks weightlifting i don't know if anyone cares or if this matters or i don't know but i guess i'm gonna just have to keep going and then figure it out i don't know i also don't know if i want coffee right now i like don't really want it i'm just gonna get it i'm gonna get starbucks now i want to go to trader joe's because now that i'm like home i'm gonna have to go back to school like a few days but now that i'm home where was I going? Oh, I need some food in the house because I like my like specific things for myself that like my family doesn't like. I get a vanilla sweet cream cold brew. That's just been my thing for like months now. I'm like so over trying to like make different drinks at Starbucks and stuff. And I also go between Dunkin' and Starbucks, but Dunkin' sometimes it's just not. I don't know. I have to be in the mood for Dunkin'. Otherwise, I'll just get Starbucks. We're gonna get that. We'll go to Trader. I want to stop at DSW because it's like right next door to it and see if they have any shoes I can get for graduation because I need shoes. I don't have any white heels, so. And those are all my updates. Other than that, I have to do some work for my internship. I want to finish my book. And then you guys are going to help me pick my next read. Because I have so many on my bookshelf that I haven't read yet. And a lot of good ones. I know everyone's going to probably wonder, like, do you still read the Addicted series? And yes, I'm still on Fuel the Fire. I'm over halfway through. What I was doing is I just have, like, my current reads that I've been reading. And then, like, during class, this don't do this but during class i would pull up like the pdf of the book and read during class <laughs> to waste the time and i got through over half the book doing that now that i'm not in class anymore obviously i'm gonna have to read like the actual book so what i was thinking was finishing 
terms and conditions, starting a new book, but also like really like giving my attention to Fuel the Fire and the Addicted series because I have the, all the books and I'm like dying to finish it. And like, don't get me wrong, like I love this series. Like I actually, like I'm obsessed with it. I just like, I wanted like new families and stories and I don't know, things. But I still love it. I just also don't want it to ever end. So, and I know there's like the children's stories and stuff, but I don't know, that's just what I'm feeling right now. So I'm gonna finish it, I swear. Now that I'm not in classes or school, I think it'll be easier for me. All right, I'm gonna get coffee. We will go to Trader. I'll give a Trader haul and talk more about my life updates because now that school's over, maybe you guys are wondering what I'm doing. And I'll tell you later. Okay. Okay guys, so, um, okay, can I make words? Can I speak sentences? So I go to Trader, ready to buy some fun stuff for myself, be healthy, and I forgot that they started May 4th today. No more bags. I'm walking around with my basket. I have so much stuff in the basket, and I'm like looking at everyone and all of the little cash register places, and there's no Trader Joe's paper bags. I asked the guy, I was like, do you have any bags I could buy? Like, I'm not carrying all of this stuff in my hands out of here, so I had to buy a bag, which isn't the worst thing in the world. The bag's actually pretty cute. I'm gonna show you, and I'm gonna show you what I got. So that happened. That was my first inconvenience. Then I go to DSW. I'm like, okay, I just need a white heel. Don't really wear heels often. And I found these, but I had to get the ones that were on display. Look at them. So the one that was on display is like stretched out here and there's like a little stain right here. You can't really see it on camera. I didn't notice until I left, but while it was on like the stand, it didn't have a price tag on it, but I was like, okay, it's a heel, $60. I don't know where I came up with that number, but I was like, it can't be more than like 80. I don't, that's just, I made that up. So I go to check out and she says it's gonna be 120. So I'm like, what were these ones? 120. So now I'm on the hunt for cheaper shoes and if I find cheaper shoes, I'm gonna return these. If I don't, I'm gonna wear them and keep them because obviously I'm gonna wear them someplace else, but I don't, like, where would I wear them to? I don't think I would ever would. That's my second dilemma. Third dilemma, Trader Joe's, I don't like. They're like granola and I wanna make, eat like yogurt with granola and stuff and they don't have granola that I personally like. So now we're going off to Target to get that. I think this is like the good thing about being out of school and not having assignments to do is that I have free range of my day right now while I'm off waiting for work to start. I have all these hours right now that I could go run errands and not feel guilty that I have stuff to do. I mean, I do have stuff to do for work, but not school. That was just another stressor added on to my life. So with that, I guess I'm gonna go get my granola. I'll give you a little Trader Joe haul when I get home and then continue on with our day. Target. I need a granola. This is my favorite granola, the kind granola, and I'm always either getting the cinnamon one or the oat oh, honey, whatever. I needed almond butter. Usually I get the vanilla one because I love it, but I didn't have it, but they had maple almond butter, so we're gonna try that. So from Trader. I got tea. I have none here at home. Peppermint tea. I usually drink it at night. I got these. I think they're just like knockoff Pringles. They are knockoff Pringles, but I love Pringles and I don't have any, so I thought these would be fun. Then I needed bread. Sourdough. Best bread ever. Always sourdough. I think I'm gonna make some avocado toast, so. I got some spinach. Oh, I got these. Cauliflower crisps. Snack. I don't know. They looked good. It said cauliflower, so I'm guessing it's like healthy. We're gonna try those soon. Peppers, avocados. I get the mini ones because I don't use a whole one and then it goes to waste. Pomegranate seeds. I love pomegranate seeds. I want to get grapes. I love the Trader Joe red grapes, but they didn't have like the box, like the brand box that I like. I was very upset about that. They have the best red grapes. We've got some yogurt. I get this yogurt. Two vanilla and two strawberry. Organic cashew yogurt. Greek yogurt is too thick for me and I feel like heavy after. I don't know. It's like too thick. So this is like, it's like thin yogurt. I really like it. I'm gonna put this so I want to make some toast and then we will fix ourselves for the day.
got ready i also just filmed content for my internship like now's a good time to talk about what i'm doing with my life i look so pale I cannot wait for summer because i need color in my face life updates let's get into it first as you guys know i have an internship i don't know if i ever said who it was with but i interned for or i've been an intern for like a year now for the brand kitsch if you've never heard of them they're like a woman-owned hair care skin care like pillowcases and stuff a really great sustainable brand they have honestly the best products like i use them every single day not even just like because I work with them like they products are amazing so I work with them I help them with their like social media stuff or like I help the people who do like the social media I help with like content and like posting stuff but they want to hire me which was amazing and I absolutely love like my boss and the people that work there so I am very excited I think I start at the end of the month the beginning of June-ish we haven't really got into that just yet I'll be working full-time with them remotely because they're in California so I'd be like their social media project manager so I'd help them with like collabs and stuff like that and it's super fun I help them with their content like it's just something that like, I really want to do and I really love the people that work there and their products and literally everything about them So I'm very happy about that along with that. I will still be doing YouTube Obviously, it's not my full-time job because I am working for kitsch But my dad said that since I got a degree I have to use it So I am working not that I don't want to but you know, I didn't go to school for nothing I am also doing YouTube. I'll be doing videos updates and vlogs and stuff like this But also book videos. I will still be reading don't worry That is my life and I just want to put it out there for you guys because I know you guys love it I love it. This is my favorite thing to do. So that's what I'll be doing and that's kind of it with like post-grad right now I kind of want to just get back into the groove of life now that well after graduation like I said work is remote so I will be home anyway I probably won't move out for a little bit I'm probably gonna start saving my money and move out this time next year so that is that life update I just filmed stuff for them I'm waiting for that to get approved and now I am gonna finish my book I have 60 pages left and then you guys are gonna help me pick my next round I have them all like lined up on my bookshelf obviously I want to film this weekend or I'm is this zoomed in? Oh, okay, so it was zoomed in the whole time. Guys, look at my closet. This weekend, I am cleaning it out. And I still have to bring clothes home from school. This does not give you stress. Like, it's stressing me. And I'm gonna, like, kind of redo my room since I'm gonna be home and working from home now. Gonna get a new desk, new bed frame, get rid of that. We're gonna clean this up. I wanna put something else up there. We'll see what happens with that. But that's that right now. I think those are, like, all the updates I have just on my life in general. I'm gonna go finish the book because I literally refuse to continue reading it. I need to finish it. Take like that long i need to like not get distracted i forgot that i posted what i read in april today i'm literally in the middle of dsw buying those shoes and it's like let everyone know your video's up and i was like oh my god that's up if you haven't watched that but yeah okay let's, let's go finish this book so we can pick out a new one because i am so beyond over this i hate starting series duologies i just need a good standalone and that's what we're picking from i don't know if any of these are series i think i have two that's in a series we're not choosing those so we'll find out what i choose in a little okay i finished thank god i started this mid-april May 4th. Gave it a 3 out of 5. I've talked about it in my last wrap up and in my next one I guess I'll talk about it again but it just felt really repetitive from the first one and I need a break from this trope of grumpy sunshine. The ending was cute but I just I'm so I was so over it. Now here are my options. Put on my story that I want to do a reading vlog, rereading Love in Other Words again. I have the new cover. I don't know if I want to reread this and like re-annotate with the new one just yet. So I think with that reading vlog, I'm just going to reread the one I already have that's already annotated and I can show you like what I highlighted and stuff. I think that's not going to be just yet. I think that'll be after the book I start now. So these are my options. I don't want to do a series. So these were all in my recent book haul video. So if you watch that, you know these books. These are all of them. So this one's a series. It's Rush by Maya Banks. It was just a random book I shows but we're not gonna start that because i don't want a series right now so this i'm gonna save for summer because it's a summer in paris it's called one summer in paris so i'm gonna wait for that one this one i also think i'm gonna save is called the truth hurts it's kind of like a mystery love romance type of book i don't know if i want to read that kind of book right now so that's gonna have to wait so now i have the devil wears black i think this is another enemy solver so absolutely not you were there too this one's kind of like a she moves with her husband it's kind of boring and then she has dreams about this guy and she ends up meeting him maybe this one or the flat share this one seemed really cute look how little the word font is you can't tell the words are tiny in this book i don't know if i want to read this one yet i also have the problem with forever but this one's like thick it's like almost 500 pages i have a million kisses in your lifetime that's also like even more thick it's like over 500 so probably save this one okay so now i'm between the problem with forever 
ever and you were there too or i have some books on my kindle oh it's dead maybe i'll read a kindle book because i love those isn't there a way to find out online i don't have a cube to charge my kindle right now but i'm gonna find that but we're gonna look at the books that are on my kindle right now because maybe we'll read one of those okay i know i said i didn't want a series but i really want to read the mindfuck series i heard it was like amazing step forward i just read it oh should i read too late by colleen hoover what's that one about i forgot no if i want to read like a dark kind of book right now the sweetest oblivion no let's look at the mind fuck series so this one they took too much left too little i had nothing to lose until him oh it's short only 132 pages i think i'm gonna read this so it's a series of i think five should we start it the first one's free are they all free okay i think they're all kindle unlimited too i downloaded it we're gonna start it i'm gonna go charge this but i think i can read it on my phone so i'm just gonna do that okay let me go put on my goodreads that i started it the first one is called the risk it's short why is it so short i don't know okay let's start it i'm excited okay so much for all of these books that i need to read it's fine we'll get to them eventually let's go charge this i'm gonna start reading on my phone <gasps> It's gonna be fun. Hi guys. Okay. Remember when I said I was gonna start the book? So I didn't do that. I ate. Don't really remember actually what I've been doing. Oh, I had to do some more stuff for my internship and I filmed like a bunch of things for them. So I did that. That took up some time and then, I don't know, I was hanging with my dogs. And I bought this new lip thing. Wait. I still changed my outfit. I don't know if you guys care, but I did change my outfit from Target. Lauren had it and I used it and I liked it. Naturium Phyto Globe Lip Balm in petal. They have different like shades. I got the petal one. But the applicator is like metal, which I like. I feel like it makes it feel more high quality. I don't know. It was $11 or $12, but it's like super thick. It reminds me of like a thicker version of like Laneige or the Summer Fridays I have. And I've been loving it. It gives like a little tint. And that's like all I'm doing today. I'm gonna go to Chris's. Wait, I've been like breaking out like bad. I don't know why, but whatever. I took my makeup off. I kept my mascara on. My lashes have been growing too, which I don't know how. I use what's it called? Grande lash for like a month max, like barely any. And all of a sudden, like I think that has to be the reason I don't do anything else to my lashes. And also the Harry Styles, like I signed up to get tickets for his one night only. And I signed up with three different emails and I'm on the wait list for every single one. So this is not good. I'm upset. Hopefully I get off the wait list because I'm, I'm going. I don't care. It's so soon. 16 days. Aside from that, I have like nothing else really to say. I'm going to go to Chris's. We're going to cook some dinner and I'm going to read a bit of this later. I'll update you guys maybe next vlog. Definitely follow my Instagram though because I post like a lot on my stories. I try to like, keep updated. I've been posting like a lot on my feed. So definitely follow me on there. I'm very active, which I've been trying so hard to be. I'm gonna do that and just relax the rest of the night. I don't have anything else planned. Kind of boring day, but it was productive. So that's good. That's like all I have. Also my camera, like the part that like flips up so I can see myself when I try to like flip it down and close it, it doesn't close. So that's concerning. I'm gonna have to bring it to Best Buy tomorrow. If I had to buy a new camera, I'd be very upset. I wanna get myself like a graduation gift to myself, like something like expensive. Not like an expensive, materialistic type of person like if i see something that i like then it's like okay but i can't just like i don't know search for something to buy i don't want to like waste my money on that i don't know i never like buying expensive things because then i end up like hating it because it's so much money i don't know if anyone else is like that i can't like explain that one but since i graduated and i'm done with school and i'm proud of myself i want to buy myself something so if you guys know of any cute like I don't know. I was gonna do a bag, but I don't really like those bags. I need like a casual comfy bag and I don't think designers make those kinds of bags. I do jewelry, but like, I don't know. I have to like look into that. I'm gonna go on a shopping spree, but the state of my closet, as you've seen, I just, I cannot buy more clothes. Chris got me those little tulips yesterday. There's a little graduation cap in the top of it. So cute. But I think it looks cute on my bookshelf. I love the pop of yellow and I love tulips. So that's that. Okay, that's the end of this vlog. I got nothing left for today. I'm gonna go start the book now. I have a feeling I'm gonna finish this really quick because the, at least the first two, I didn't look at the the last no i don't know which ones i looked at but first one is like 100 pages and then the other one i looked at was like 90 something so i'm excited this should be fun i need something like entertaining and this sounded like really perfect so i'll put it you guys somewhere along the way i'm probably gonna vlog again this week because i'm like i know i missed it i'm enjoying it so i'll keep you updated with my next vlog definitely check my instagram because i post like so many updates there i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know any comments questions concerns in the, the comments down below that's all i got for you i will see you hopefully in the next one bye